Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how to enter recovery mode on your Lenovo Yoga uh, Idea Pad. Sorry, Lenovo Idea Pad 5. In order to do it, um, it, you can like enter it without knowing your Microsoft account, but there's a chance you won't be able to exit it without the Microsoft account. So before we enter it as an additional layer of security, you know, just so we don't lose our data on the laptop, because in case your laptop gets locked with bit, with this BitLocker recovery key and you don't know the recovery key, then the only way to uh, restore it is to install Windows again and it'll all like erase all the data that's on your drive but by the way there is a video on our channel on how to install Windows from a USB drive but you probably don't want to do that it's better to have your data that you currently have so let's begin by making sure we have access to the Microsoft account and to do that I'd recommend going to this website which I have here at the top. I don't know if you can see it. It's aka.ms slash my recovery key, of course, without spaces. Mm, so this website, you should go on it and don't mistake all the like dots and slashes because if it happens, then uh, you may get to a scammer website. You should be able to log in with the Microsoft account in here. So I'm just going to click on send code to send it to my email and I'm going to type that in and get back to you when that's typed in. Okay, and now I am in and the page is loading. It should look sort of like this. And here you'll see device name, key ID, recovery key, drive and key upload date. And I'm going to explain everything if uh, later when my drive actually gets locked with BitLocker. So let's go to the recovery mode, which in order to do, you'll need to first shut your laptop down. If it's currently on, of course. And now I'll wait for like half a minute and then flip your laptop over because at the back of your laptop, you will see this little hole. And you need to insert a pin, needle or anything else into that. Once you press on the button inside, it'll automatically turn the laptop on so you don't need to press on any buttons now. Okay, and now um, with arrows, select system recovery. It should say please wait. If it does, then it's great. We've accomplished the recovery mode now you can do here whatever you need to do here uh, I'm just gonna try to like make the bit locker happen so I'm gonna do a startup setting so I can put into safe mode for example let's see if we get the bit locker probably we don't because I think I might have like forgotten about signing into the Microsoft account yeah so if the BitLocker happens, you'll see a white field where you need to enter the recovery key and underneath it, you'll see recovery key ID. And the key ID will be quite long, but the first section of it is the most important. That's what you should match with the key ID on the website. By the way, the list on the website is not sorted by date. So you just need to scroll through all of these to find the right one. Um, if you find the right one on the right side of it, you'll see this long recovery key ID and you need to enter the whole one. Mm, so you can simply um, then when it's entered correctly, click on enter and um, you can, once you unlock it with BitLocker, you can simply finish whatever you're doing in recovery mode. Now I'm in the safe mode, by the way. If you want to exit safe mode, then simply restart your laptop. And that's all for this video. That's all for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.